salutations, my friends, and welcome back to the Victory of the Dual Monarchy mod, in which we're playing as Austria-Hungary, and as you can see on screen, we are currently looking at our intelligence agency, which I asked you guys yesterday, what should her name be for the intelligence agency, and so on recommended, with some extra support from other people, saying it should be the Evidence Bureau, in which we have now formed that. Now, we can continue investing in the intelligence agency, but for now, let's keep building our own selves up first. We have a couple of comms to get through, and right now, we are helping out the Bulgarians fight the Romanians and the Serbs. So, we'll see what happens. Let's definitely see what happens. What do we have outdated? Oh, yeah. The ships. Ships. Always ships. Hey, nice. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and extend this. We have a better chance of, like, smashing through uh, to boot Bucharest. To begin, we got diplomatic effort, which is awesome. So, a couple of the comments say, Someone recommends I attack Germany, take Bavaria, Silesia, and southern Poland. So, let's see. Do, in my mind, we kind of already own southern Poland. If you want to think of Krakow, southern Poland, which it probably is. As well as maybe Lviv. Lviv? Lviv? Uh, maybe even Lublin. We'll see what happens. I make no promises. So, even though it would be kind of nice to get Bavaria. Maybe even Baden-Württemberg as southern Germany. But I've definitely... Uh, Schlesen? Schlesen? And this region here, of course, would be nice as well. We'll see what happens. I really don't know what the unification events are for between Austria, Hungary, and Germany, if there are any, which I hope there are. Eventually, I'm sure there will be. And someone said, actually, some of the devs said that these generic companies will be changed out later on, which is totally cool. Like I said in the, yesterday's video, uh, the devs have said that they are going to have an update for uh, this mod, especially for Austria, Hungary. So we'll see what happens. Coke, and that just means I'll play as Austria, Hungary again someday later down the line. To see the changes. At least show them on the channel. Because I might just play them off on my own time to explore what we got. So, Balkan politics, assertive position in Asia, European diplomacy. So, someone also recommended yesterday that I. Well, I could, I could guess technically retake Italy if I wanted to. But. Embargo Germany, rekindle the old alliance, embargo Russia. Embargo France. Someone wants me to reinvite Italy into our, you know, alliance. It currently doesn't look like we can, so I, I apologize we can't, but I'm going to go with Balkan politics just so we can see if we can support Bulgaria or Romania first. Obviously, we want to support Bulgaria since we're actually sending them volunteers. The Balkans is an important region for us. We must form alliances or seize land in the powder keg of Europe. Or cease lands? Seize. So S-E-I-Z-E, -E, not cease, like stop, but seize land. Cool. Alright, so instead of moving that way, actually, everyone just come here. You need help out, take Bucharest. Maybe take oh, they just threw another division in there. Ooh, they're helping out down there now. The Ottoman Empire seeks to join the Confederacy of Austria-Hungary. As the current upheavals and international politics continue to reverberate throughout the world, the Ottomans have deemed us to be their greatest chance of surviving these tumultuous times. They therefore request to be admitted into our alliance so that we may, we may weather the, the coming storm together. We are better off without them. You know, the, with the way they're smashing the hell out of the Greeks, I mean, look at that. They didn't even finish off in Bursa or Afyon or Izmir, but they literally retook Athens already. They already took the capital. So, I'm going to say, and whether we shall, yeah. Let them come right on in. We could probably join the war. And last time, we did get a surprise guest of Great Britain joining us as well. So, this is a very, very interesting take on how, what if Austria-Hungary won World War One? We would get the British on our side as well as the Ottomans. Which seems very, very weird. Uh, maybe not so much for the Ottomans, but at least for the Brits to be on our side. Seeing as we weren't exactly, you know, on the friendliest relations with the Brits during World War One or the Weltkrieg. But, you know what? That's okay. Respond to the eruption of the Third Balkan War. Oh, we can send more volunteers. Uh, okay. Support the Kingdom of Romania. Mm, we could support them, but we. I want to save my own stockpiles. We'll say for now. <sighs> hmm. Now we have these guys. I could be called into the war against the, uh, the Greeks. Really, I don't think we want to do that. I really want to go to war with these guys. Let's see. Are we justifying? No, we're not, which is fine. I do want to spend some political power, though. I really, really do. Actually, how many resources do we have? We're actually doing really, really well in resources. Really well. Minus the robber, of course, but that's pretty much any campaign. Anything else here? Artillery. Artillery will be very important as well. Defense. We're probably going to need defense of all things. I'm going to go and grab artillery. This we attack a little bit more harshly. And this should help out right here. Nice. Get in there. Good. We got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Can we do that and just go right there? That'd be actually really great if we could. So this is the way we cut off these Romanian divisions completely. And now we have some military police, which is awesome. It's 1939, my friends. Let's go ahead and grab some artillery, which we are. <clears throat> Planes are doing okay. Don't really need to upgrade them yet, which we will need to. We can get some radar. 
grab some more construction speed. Yeah, that'd be good. Refinery's great. Civilian factory's great. Oh, wait, sending back five divisions to the Austro-Hungarian Empire. Oh, we did send volunteers to someone else. Who did we send volunteers to? I can't remember. Oh, look at China. Ooh, if Japan is doing that well... Hmm. China likes us, but so does Japan. A non-aggression pact with the Russian Republic? It's looking like if they're doing a non-aggression pact with the, with the Russian Republic, it might be worth it. Oh, what? They want. They might still attack the, the Philippines, though. Oh, Alf Landon. We might be able to get Japan in our faction, as well as the Russian Republic, maybe? Maybe? I can't even remember where we were at, originally. Who did we send volunteers to? All I know is that I want... I don't want to be involved in the Second Valkyrie immediately, please. Leave me out of that for now. Help him out, help him out. And we did leave most of our air superiority down here, though. Oh, from Trieste. No. I honestly can't remember from the last episode. Because I know we sent more divisions. We, we helped out the Russians earlier, too. So, I remember that, but... Mm. Come on. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Come on. Please. Seriously, please. Forcefully, please. <laughs> Cut them off and you can kill all those Romanians off. Oh, do they have the French down there? Oh, boy, they do. Oh, we got them. Good. Cut them off, which is awesome. They still can't reach to the sea, which is good. <sighs> nice. And now the capital is over here, it looks like, maybe? Oh, wait. Where's the Romanian capital? Oh, we got another operative. Sarah Hoffman. Fritz Vilbs. Hildegard Weber. I kind of like... This guy, just because he's got sunglasses on. I like Hildegard, because Hildegard, I don't see too many Hildegard and Sarah. Well, she's a smoker, so we want to make sure she we get operatives that can last a long time in the field. Because smoking probably isn't very good for you. At least that's what I've been told. Can look cool sometimes, but we need some more support equipment and motorized. Support equipment. Yes. Motorized. Let's bring it up to two. We got actually a lot of support. Light tanks. So let's do that. Where are my light tanks? Oh, we got... Oh, God. We're going to need even more motorized after we do this. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and make these six for now. We're going to emphasize light tanks for quite a while until we can get enough. Let's see. That's definitely worth doing. Let's grab those. Uh, I'm going to throw on... Not that stuff. Oh, God. We're going to need... Oh, more motorized. Oh, God dang it. I should send my motorized. Why did I send infantry? Because I sent these guys somewhere else. That's right. That makes more sense. Boom. Boom. There you go. Good. Lock train, please. Thank you. Help out. Push them in. And actually, help out down here, too. Alright. So, we got our planes. They're helping out mostly just Bulgaria. Which is fine by me, even though this air base is not that large. Come down here, then. There you go. That helps out. That definitely helps out. Oh, wait. Where did those planes go? Adriatic Coast. Fighters? Ooh. Well, then come back up here, then. Not enough int Oh, wait, you're over here. Oh, we can only send 100. Okay, that makes more sense. Hmm. You know what? Just keep them doing whatever they want for now. I don't really care. Seriously, where's the capital? Balkan politics? Let's go ahead and support. I want to do all this stuff. I really do. And we need to develop ourselves more, but it's only one civilian factory. Get some more factories, infrastructure... That extra research slot would be so good, though. But we're going to go ahead and support Bulgaria, maybe. And then, obviously, the Ottoman Empire. It looks like what we should really do is revive the Ottoman Alliance. And then we got to make a decision with attacking Serbia. Cool. European diplomacy, maybe. Mm, it's 35 days. That's not bad. Get more political power. We need to do Legacy of the Valkyrie as well. But that's actually only 35 days as well. That's actually really cool. Uh, there's so much I want to do. So much. Don't want annexation. I don't want to... Actually, we can lower our stability. We do get cores on them. Ooh, people don't like that. Let's do that after we work through this. Let's go and support Bulgaria. Bulgaria will be the strongest ally we can make in the Balkans, and it's time we recognize that. We're making our choices here, my friends. And next up, we shall grab... What? Or who? Recovery rate. Ooh, that would not be bad. New army doctrines. That would probably be pretty good to do. Light aircraft. I mean... Fighters, that's always good to do. Industry, I love industry, so I'm going to grab industrial research speed. We're always going to use that, probably. Alright, next up, you guys come here. You guys can probably win. 
with enough support with these guys, you should probably win. Where is it? Seriously, where's their capital? Nice. Oh man, the Ottomans have done such a great job. Holy cow. Bulgarians, not so much down here, because they're still technically losing land, but it is what it is. And where are you guys at? You're guarding around there. Wait, so what are you... You guys are up... Oh, you guys are just hanging out. There you go. We'll reform this. That'd be fine. For now, do that. Because this division, just in case, is coming down here next to the Italians. I don't really trust too many people here. Governor von Hetzendorf, thank you for joining. Uh, new general? Erwin von Lahausen. Lahausen. Interesting name, but sure, why not? Train until you don't need to train anymore. And we're going to wait to get more tanks. I don't want to produce any more... Eh, technically, I do want to produce more tanks, but whatever. Uh, let's do this. Man. Because the Bulgarians are not doing well down here. The Serbs and their allies are pushing pretty darn hard. Let's see what happens. Let's push this way to get to Krajova. Why don't we take that? Will that do anything for us? Well, we might be able to circle them. Maybe. That'd be kind of cool. Oh, we get attacked immediately. You guys start attacking there. That'd be fine. Cut those guys off. Oh, okay, they're dead. These are out of supply. That's nice. Looks like we still can't win there, but that's fine. Help out. Kill them off. Hey, look. Another divisions. Another divisions? V divisions. Good. Hey, we're doing really well for Romania now. That's actually pretty good for us. If that's the case, we can wait over here. I think it'd probably be a good idea to help just smash Serbia. These guys should be able to just defend, hopefully. Better, 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 better stuff. Good. It is September 7th. So far, war's not broken out. I'm not sure if or when it will, so... Special forces, eh, that's okay. Let's get some more south attacking organizations, since we do have quite a few mountaineers already. Grab a few more guys, just in case the Italians want to strike us, which would not be very good for us. And we have two heavy cruisers. Oh. Oh. Oh, good lord. Oh, what up? What are you... Are these heavy cruisers or... They're heavy cruisers with... Mm, why do you paint me like this? Oh, my goodness. Go ahead and train if you need it. It's always worthwhile getting more naval XP, but... Oh, my goodness. I mean, our navy... Obviously, Austria-Hungary is not known for its navy, but still. Right, go ahead and help them out if you can. By help them out, we can kill them. Uh, oh, the Serbs are here. That's why they're mostly winning... Three more divisions. They're actually attacking to escape. Doesn't look like we can win. So be it. Whatever. <sighs> you know what? Screw it. I'm, we're going back this way then. We're going to help take these guys out first on this side. And then we'll switch sides. Support Bulgaria. The fall of Constantinople. Will this finally end the sick man of Europe? Wow. That is, that is quite gutsy to do that. Holy cow. What? Good job, Greeks, I guess. Um... I don't think anyone was expecting you to do that, but let's get some more engineers. That'll be good for the future. Better guns, yes please, and support the Ottoman Empire. The Ottomans deserve better than how it ended for them in the Veldkrieg. It was wrong for us to let them off or let them suffer the way they did. We must help them reclaim the once great empire they had. God, I hope this is a, a good decision to make. Still building, still building. Radar would be beneficial as well, but whatever. Alright. We're almost there. I already kicked some more butt. Attacking these three is going to be kind of a pain in the butt, but, uh... You know what? With the Bulgarians here, we should be able to do so. Force the attack. We should be able to push through them. Alright, motorize is getting worse. Support equipment is getting actually a little worse as well. Ooh. Edward Barger will do a good job, though. Go straight up that way. Immediately attack. Don't give him time to rest. No time to rest. And we do have a couple of decaf... What kind of decaf coffee? It's kind of a mixture of decaf and, uh, academia nut coffee, so... Oh, you were so close to getting in there. So close. So don't lose too much land and you'll do okay, Bulgaria. Austrians are here to help. Nice. Can't really quite help out there. That's fine. Whatever. G Galati? Nice. We gotta take that port, though. Well, actually, actually... Yeah, I suppose we still have to. Wait, revive the Ottoman Alliance. Okay, support the Ottoman Empire. Oh, yeah, so we, we're already allied, so that's absolutely great. We have to... The, note, the Third Balkan War has started. Let's go and do European diplomacy, just in case we get options for this, so... The most important area for diplomacy in our, is our, in our own backyard. Europe. Europe has always been a chaotic continent of powerful empires. It is time we make an alliance or find out who our real enemies will become. Or will be. 
Let's see, let's go ahead and make some, a few more military factories. We're done making civilian factories at the current moment, but we're not done for this campaign. We're making those types of factories. You guys could attack there. Uh, okay, since they're helping out, you might as well help out too. Could you win actually here, maybe? They're, they are entrenched. Lukov is maybe not the most experienced general, but that's okay. Barger. Nice. Very nice. Stay right here, guys. If you take Yasi. I don't know how to pronounce that. Yasi? That'd be okay, but it looks like you kind of failed already. That's fine. Whatever. Take all the land you can. Keep them occupied. You know, help support the attack, too. Hey, we have a random division. Nice. Okay, Romania's gone. That's exactly what we wanted to see. So it looks like these guys are really struggling. We might consider doing this first. I didn't realize I'd be so invested in Bulgaria right now. But it is what it is. Okay, it's 30... Germany, what are you up to? German Imperial... Ooh, expansion, huh? Focus on un unstable Russia. Focusing on influencing China. German expansion to the west. Gateway to Europe. Violate Swiss neutrality. Finish off the British Empire. Oh boy. Yeah, it looks like odds are we'll probably have to go to war with the Germans eventually. To the south. Support Serbia, Bulgaria. They're going to support Serbia, probably. We'll probably support Romanian claims. Or Greece. Renew our alliance with Italy. Not intervention with Hungary. Destroy the Ottomans. Invade Spain. Portugal. Hey, they got trees to do stuff. That's cool. <clears throat> the start in Bulgaria is looking kind of thick, though. Kind of thick. Give her guys some... Oh, that's a lot of divisions down there. Wow. Where are our planes? They're still hanging out. Uh, get up to 100, then. There you go. Come on back. Time for some coffee, too. Eh, we're not doing bad. The pain eight incident. Okay, cool. I didn't realize that was still in the game, but awesome. Oh, why are you attacking there? You actually might be able to win here, though. Yeah, you can definitely win there. We got enough stuff for this. We can't go to that. Uh, naval stuff. We can probably ignore that for now. Defense. Call Bruna. Oh, man. I don't know which one to choose. Naval stuff. Metro designer. Let's grab some, uh, infantry. That'd be good. Hey, we actually won there. Nice. Actually, if you're fast enough, you can move up there. Probably won't be able... Oh! 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 Hey! Sometimes you get nice little hidden fun surprises. Beautiful. Just hold the line. And kill them off. I did not think that would actually work. I didn't know that we would actually get that too. Beautiful. We just killed off five enemy divisions. Oh, it's so good. So good. Let you guys spread around European diplomacy. Let's go ahead and focus on ourselves a little bit more with Della Trento. Trento's lacking in any form of industry. By adding some factories in the state, we, it'll boost our economy. We get a whole one factory. Wow. Right, so we probably got to attack here next. It is for us, so it's not great, but... With five divisions here, we should maybe do okay? Maybe, yeah, yeah. Is this still considered Bulgaria? It is. So that's nice. And we have enough to do this. Motorize. There you go. Now we're probably going to need even more. Actually, not that much more. That's not bad. Light tanks are looking great, though. And half you guys are going to come slinking down through there. Good, 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 good. Ukraine. Actually, I could probably take the Ukrainian divisions if I need to to help bolster our defenses here, but... We'll see. Uh, let's grab some more machine tools. Get more cap. That'd be great. And have a sip of coffee. Looking pretty good. Actually, is this core Serbian territory? It is. This, however, is not. We might consider attacking up farther up north, maybe. You guys can help support the attack there. Uh, you might win here, too. Yeah, just keep... Edward Barger, you're doing a great job. Barger, Barger. Oh, uh, yeah, they won't attack us. Yeah, why not? Why not? Help out. Help out if you can, maybe. Support the attack, maybe. How is Serbia doing? With the loss of Romania, built up the Serbian Air Force, they have a little bit more manpower. Uh, Bulgaria has quite a bit more, so that's cool to see. Finish them off. Finish them off. Force the attack. We still get air superiority here, and we have 110 air XP. Nice. I want to get over here quickly, though. Good. Get over there. Now defend, we don't want to spend too much... Oh, come on, we could have made an encirclement. Develop Trento, 
And now we're going to go ahead and do Legacy of the Valkyrie. The Valkyrie showed the world horrors that had never been seen before, but also showed us our lack of an effective military. We must reform a military or else we will not be able to defend our empire from with, out, from outside forces, which would not be very good. Uh, so do we get some more rubber? Yes, we did. We need just one more rubber, and which we'll get that done in Veen. And some more military factories. 100%. Nice. There we go. One, two, three, and then keep working on Southern Slovakia. Not really. Do that. And that one. Nice. I'm sure the Italians really don't like us since we do own, you know, Veneto still. But that's them. That's their fault. That's their problem. Uh, improved computing machine. Good. Can only get 1.7 a day. Holy cow. That's nice. Let's see. We shouldn't need that many more divisions to help defend Italy, but you know what? You never know. Now, we do have more divisions. Let's see. Motorize. we got to increase you by, like, two more factories just because we're going to change things out here. Are we running out of infantry equipment? No, we're not. Support equipment is looking a little better. Infantry divisions, you're looking not bad. These infantry divisions are looking not bad either. Well, I'm tempted to switch this over as well to artillery. Do we have enough out of that? No, we don't. We're getting close, so we got to wait. And then Alpenier divisions, artillery. Actually, doing this for artillery would not be bad. But I'm going to save this for 40 combat with stuff. I said that before. I'm going to I'm going to wait. Motorized. Eh, we could change it. I'm not really interested in that right now, though. Panzer divisions. Just get a little bit more army XP and we'll be good. In a few days. And here we will. Throw them on. Good. Because support artillery is always great to have. Anything else different? What was all this stuff? Make Somalia land a core of the Austro-Hungarian Empire. Oh, wait, how do we do that? What, do you see this? Do you see these decisions? Ah, uh, where, 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 oh, please. Can I, can I make Triple Italia a core of the Austro-Hungarian Empire? Oh, that'd be so cool. I'm not seeing it, though. Oh, I'm not seeing it. Oh, don't get my hopes up. Oh, my goodness, that sounds like a lot of fun. Now we're going to get some light aircraft companies, because that... Will just be really beneficial for us. Engineer 2s, great. It's 1940. Happy 1940, my friends. A new year. Maybe new us. Let's get some more defense, just in case. And breakthrough. Defense and breakthrough are always nice to have. All right, with all of you guys here, we can probably attack there, which attacking into the mountains really sucks, but welcome to the Balkans. <sighs> Gotta love that coffee. Nice job, guys. Nice job. We're really smashing the hell out of the Bulgarians. Five more divisions. That should be good enough for the Italian front. Should be, at least. Motorized support equipment. Yeah, just get maybe two more. There you go. How are the factories making? Going along? It's going okay. Alright, since you're all here, you must help out with that. And you must move to the Skopje. Hopefully we can win here, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. We, maybe we can't. That's not good. Let's guess you guys hold. And you guys support the attack over here. Of course, the Bulgarians are leading the way, and they're not doing that well over there, which is fine. Whatever. Happens. I'm just going to shift you guys around. Come right here. Looks like there might be a river here, which would be very bad for us, but whatever. Ah, I see. So now we got to shift our planes a little further to uh, the Adriatic coast. We can do that as well. Legacy of the Velk Creek. Awesome. New army doctrines. <clears throat> Might as well, right? The doctrines of old are clearly outdated and will no longer work in the modern era. It is time we develop new tactics to use in combat. Hey, it's not 70 day focus, it's a 65 day focus. Seems to be a very peaceful world, minus China and Japan killing each other in the Balkans. Wow, I think we might want the Japanese, but I don't want to fight against America, so. We'll see what happens. And Germany, what are you up to? You're, you're, you're very quiet. German expansion to the south. Oh, crap, that's not good. Okay, uh, what is the French up to? They're over here getting another research slot. Hopefully they go to war with Italy. I want to see them continually going down in here. Woo, Italy is not in a faction. They did this. Retake Algeria. They already did that. Conquer Spain, but friend Spain. They need to do this one. So they're just waiting to go to war with maybe Italy, perhaps? Unless they already did that focus and they have a war goal against them. No, no, they don't have a war goal against them yet. Not yet, at least. Not yet. If anything, attacking here would probably be the most beneficial. Okay, maybe we'll support the attack up here instead. There you go. Break over the river if you can. That'll be good. Nice. Which opens up a lot of options here. It's very good. Half you guys immediately go north. Oh, no. They didn't like that. I'm going to go this way, too. 
They're going to be expanding their lines as much as possible right now. If we can get over there and circle these guys, that'd be so decisive. We'd actually link up with ourselves. Huh. That's the most important thing. Don't let them move. Do not let them move. Boom, we got them. They have six. I'm going to assume at least ten to twelve divisions trapped. We literally just walked in. That's literally what we did. We just walked in and was like, hey guys, don't mind if we do. And I'm like, okay. Nice. Very, very good. Factory wise, uh, just one more, just one more. Then we'll get some more motorized and more planes. And these guys made a colossal mistake. A completely colossal mistake, which is awesome. Oh, yeah. They're pretty much screwed now. Go in it, force the attack. You're probably going to win pretty much almost anywhere, maybe except over here. Which would not be very good if we lost, but whatever. Good. Look at that air XP, not bad. We should probably focus a little bit more on our air power, but that's okay. Yep. Destined to die. That's what they are. Oh, so oh wow, look at that. Our force attack was a really bad idea for the mountaineers. Holy crap, ah, that was my bad. My bad. My fault. I just wanted us to do so well that we killed our wrong division almost. Okay, seriously, you stop attacking. Y'all, just kind of hold for now. Uh, that's a lot of guys we lost there. Hope it was worth it. We've lost how many guys? 37,000. That's actually quite a few guys to get involved in the Balkans, but you know what? What else is new? Everyone but uh, you. Yeah, but you. There you go. Not bad. Actually, if you can do that, help them out there, that'd be great. Belgrad is a frontline city, my friends. Which what would be good if we took everyone here and attacked this way first to encircle all of these guys over there. Smash the loving crud out of them, get some more political power to do whatever we want to do with it. And if we get some more war support, actually, that'd be really nice. I guess not. New army doctrines are very good, though. Ship designers, let's get some armor stuff, tank designers. Might as well. So, we get the bo bonus for land doctrines now, which is awesome. Support the high staff. Hungarian military staff. Ooh, more superior firepower, towed artillery, I love that stuff, or support the Austrian staff system. Well, mobile warfare focused stuff, improved armor, improved artillery, improved equipment, which does not look bad for more production, and a bonus of mechanized models, military armament, victors of the Valkyrie will be gone, a double bonus for land doctrine, we're going to focus on this side, so support the Austrian military staff. They are calling for a doctrine to bring quick victory or blitzkrieg. This will be more effective because of other nations will be still trying to figure out or to modernize their old tactics and will not be prepared for a war based on speed. I love speed. Not the drug, no, 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 drugs are not good, but, you know, whatever. Alright, take him out. I, I can imagine that if we were in the Austrian military right now, we would just be looking at these guys and be like, Hey, hope you're having fun. Hope you're having a great time killing off the Serbs. Have fun, bye-bye. Oh, hey, Greece has finally capitulated without any of our help. And they actually gave, they didn't even puppet these guys, huh? Well, we restored him. The House of Bluxberg. That's kind of cool. And we have House of Osman. Oh, they just have the white piece. Oh, they didn't even... You didn't even puppet them. That's a... Okay. Uh, I was not expecting that. Let's get some uh, better fighters, though. Well, the sacrifice of 37, 38,000 Austrian soldiers. Uh, I guess I'll say that uh, hopefully it was worth it. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Alright, you know what? With those soldiers back, I'm probably going to help out the Empire of Japan. Maybe. Unless, how far... Where is... Oh, they own Chong Queen. How close is China to capitulating? Oh, they're close. Holy crap, they're close. Um, That's not good. They have a lot of resistance. Though. Holy cow. Ah, uh, the forces are back home. Good job, guys. You all deserve a good rest, but you're not going to rest anytime soon. Come over here. Help out the front line against Germany. Maybe, potentially. What happened to my di divisions? Uh, hold on. What happened to my divisions? Did I click? I might have clicked on something. That, where's my generals? Uh, what happened to the front line staff system? Hello. Well, at least we can still see him like this. But, um... Hello? <laughs> what happened to him? Did I click on something? I might have clicked on something. No? No? Okay, I lost my generals. Sorry. 
Okay, sure, why not? That's a big Bulgaria boy, though. Bulgarian boys. I want to help out the Japanese. I can technically want to help out both. But how are the Japanese faring? Because they have a lot of resistance. They still have enough manpower. Lots of divisions. You guys are running out of divisions. I guess technically... Oh, I guess we could send you volunteers for now. We can send six now. That's not bad. I'm going to send another mountaineer. Which one would be better? Defend Japan, defend China, defend Singapore. It doesn't really matter too much, I guess. War with China with them. I just hope that we can get to Russia. I don't want to hurt Russia. We could do that. If we ally with the Germans, we'll go to war with Russia. If we ally with the Russians, we go to war with Germany. It's probably a good idea actually to get a new alliance with us and Russia together. Hmm. If I do this, this might provoke... Japanese aggression. We'll see what happens. I don't know. They're holding okay for now. And the more resistance the Japanese take, the much worse it'll be for them. Oh my goodness. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, never mind. The Chinese might lose now because since there's so many open holes. Oh, don't tell me they didn't get any of the divisions from uniting China. Oh, they might have. They might have. Maybe not. Oh, that's so not good. Oh, I think it's, it's over for. I, I sent it. Soldiers to the wrong group. God dang it. <laughs> My bad. Oh god, please don't tell me I'm over here. Okay, good. You guys are down here. Uh, oh, I don't want to see all that stuff. There we go. Um, yeah, they really annexed all the other parts of China, but they didn't get their divisions. That is such a colossal mistake to have happen. I can put you guys right here to help out and hold, but mm, I don't know. Go and do that too. That'd be good. Fill up those lines. That'd be great. Okay, so we got enough artillery, we got enough, like, pretty much anything, even motorized now, which is pretty nice. Uh, remove that and convert them to this. Remove that, and then just throw on more of this. And at this point, just, there you go. 20 combat width, not bad. You're on high priority. Start making, like, two of them at a time. Since light tanks are cheap, 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 cheap. Over here, we're gonna grab field hospitals just in case. That'd be nice. M3 plus one. We gotta get one more thing here for that. And local garrisons. Oh, I did want to convert convert this to military police. That's why we research that. That'll be good. That saves up. Maybe something here and there. Well, I'm just here for the XP at this point. I could send them planes, but um, oh, we can see. How many planes can we send? Oh, and you can stop doing that. There you go. 300 we have. Almost 300, so we'll probably send in 200 things of fighters. That'd probably be for the best. Get quite a more air XP, but we're going to lose quite a few planes as well. Oh, China, please hold. As long as the Japanese aren't moving... As long as the Japanese aren't moving in too much, you'll do okay, I guess, but... Oh, wow, look at our guys are looking pretty darn weak here. And we beat them up. And we're defending again. Well, hope you're learning a lot, Edward. Hope you really are learning a lot. Edward... Edward. Edward. Oh, you guys are probably doing that. Uh, yeah, I should probably do that area first. That'll be good. Alright, a new alliance. I kind of want to see what Jap Germany does. A sort of position in Asia. We should probably, probably do that too. We have colonies all over Asia, so our influence over the region must be secured. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Oh, look at that. Oh, man, we're defending as best we can. Hey, there's Wuhan. Found Wuhan. You can help support the attack, too. I have a good feeling that Ch Japan will still win. That's going to be very, very costly, though, in terms of like resistance and stuff like that. We're defending over a river, too, which is not bad for us. As long as we don't get encircled and stuff. Nice. And these are the 19 combat with divisions. I'm tempted to make some of my... Some of my divisions are a little bit stronger in some areas. Oh man, they are attacking like a bunch of crazy people. Let's go and grab. We could wait on that. Get some artillery. That'd be nice. All right, artillery wise, that's good. Let's go and come over here. I'm converting all of the infantry to do that. Boom. We gain manpower, 5,500. We need some more equipment though. Oh god. This is very weird. How we not gone to? No one. There's no global conflict yet. It's very weird. Very weird. That's okay. If we don't get into some sort of... If there's not a global conflict in this episode, I promise you in the next one there will be. We'll go to war with somebody. Seeing it, especially seeing as... We need to get Bulgaria with us. Boy, the Ukraine. It's us. 
uh, the Ottoman Empire did a really great job. So, after this, we can't do war with Greece. The Balkan War started. Da -da -da. Attack Serbia. Well, they're gone. So, yeah. We'll definitely get into some sort of major global conflict soon enough. Ship designer might as well. Cool. I'm just here for the army XP. Oh crap, they're defeating us all over the place. That's not good. Oh crap, that's not good. Uh, maybe don't cancel it yet. We might still be able to win and break over there. That'd be good. Oh, we got over there, but now we lost immediately. And you guys get immediately attacked. That's fine. Alright, so at this point, I'm going to go ahead and make a re do this right here. There you go. I'm just here for the army XP. Quite literally. Oh, don't get encircled. For the love of God, do not get encircled. Come on, guys. Move, 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 move. Okay, we got one. We got one. Leave. If the Chinese divisions die, that's not my fault. That's not my problem. Uh, next up, let's go and do develop Trieste. Trieste is lacking any form of industry. By adding some factories in the state, it'll boost our economy. Great. And right now, victors of the Velk Creek, we get 1% more population if we actually helped out with this. Ooh, that hurts our land dodge. We should probably get rid of that. Those debuffs aren't looking good. I'm trying to help you out, China. I'm doing the best I can. Oh, but they're just coming in steamrolling all over the place. You can't have that much manpower, right? I mean, like, it should be going down quite a bit with all this resistance building up more and more and more and more, so... But that's just my take on it. Where's my planes? Oh, they're over here. That's fine. Cool. Hopefully they can do okay-ish. Get some more uh, air XP as well. 0.75, almost 0.25 a day. That's nice. Oh, well. Oh, man. They're really just trying to beat the snot out of our guys. Italy... Oh, demands return of Venice and Lombardy. The Italians have demanded the return of the former territories of Venice and Lombardy. If we don't return the land, they will threaten the war us with the act of war. Uh, they're by themselves. We have... Uh, some divisions down here. I'm going to convert you guys to get down here immediately. Or is it over here? It's over here, yeah. You guys, you know what? Screw that. Screw you guys. I don't need to defend against Bulgaria. There you go. Move on over, guys. We might be in a war before too long, my friends. Cool. Hey, light cruisers. Cool. Uh, send one here, and then send another one right there. Cool. Uh, Ship-wise, we're making some light cruisers. We probably should make some of this. Carriers. Oh, I forgot that we wanted to make some carriers, too. Uh, you guys are looking, well, looking okay-ish. Not great. Into air one. Anything else? Battleship armor two. I guess it's okay. Uh, Anti-air, we don't have that much of. Heavy batteries. Might as well grab that. There you go. It'll have to work. There you go. All right, let's get our guys in there and make them get some entrenchment. I should really pay attention to what's going on in China since we are invested in there right now. Oh, we're still holding very nicely, actually. All right, four days left. Let them attack us still. Please attack me in the mountains, please. All right, let them come. Okay, they declared war on us, and we're done investing over there. All right, then. 1940. We're going to get some tactical bombers. we got to put our ships out. Uh, how big is the Italian Navy, actually, first? Let's talk about that. Let's see. Uh, they have quite a few uh, heavy cruisers. But for us, we have quite a few battleships. So I'm thinking, let's do this. You guys come down here as well. I'm going to call in all my allies, because screw the Italians. Hopefully Germany doesn't go with the Italians, but we'll see what happens. You will be used on the Italian front. Great. Uh, which means we're going to have to... We're probably going to lose quite a few guys. Oh boy. Oh boy. But, you know what? It is what it is. Better fighters. Don't mind if we do. And we call it an all our allies, and we shall end this episode by doing this. Uh, you guys, by doing that, and getting a few more planes in the air so that we can make sure that we don't all die. Good and good. Doubly good. Boom, boom, boom. Get you guys down in half. And there you go. Hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we will defeat the Italians and maybe go to war with Russia or Germany. I don't know. Thanks for watching, guys.
Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we have a great time again together. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.